late nights working, or studying, or maybe it's your turn to take care of the newborn. Whatever the reason, your lack of sleep is evident, not just in your mood or grogginess, but it's written all over your face, literally. On top of the bags and the red puffy eyes, the twin duffels on your face are in two matching colors, black. That's right, the dark circles around your eyes are undeniable. Outside of lack of sleep, what else causes this to happen? Sometimes men get a great night's sleep and still wake up with the unavoidable darkness. There are several factors that can play into black bags. The number one cause, age. Lack of rest, poor diet, stress, worry, or maybe even genetics could flame this fire of the precocious circles around your eye. Other common causes include genetics, allergies, rubbing and scratching from allergies, dermatitis and eczema, fatigue, lack of sleep, heavy smoking and drinking, heredity and pigmentation, irregularities, sun exposure, which causes the body to produce more melanin, thinning skin and loss of fat and collagen, which makes the blood vessels under your eye more apparent. It's important to note that the skin under the eyes is the thinner than the rest of the face. Over time, the fat cells deplete, showing the dark shade of the veins underneath. For this reason, aging is the number one cause, but there are several factors that add to it. We have to remember that the area around the eye is still skin, and just like all of the skin on our body, it is sensitive and should be handled with care because it can become inflamed, discolored, and bruised. Dark circles tend to age the appearance of a person, and while wrinkles or gray hair are a mark of modest aging, dark circles are not. If someone is staring, wouldn't you prefer the reason to be triggered by interest not induced by unsightly circles? So, how to prevent the dark circles and puffy bags under your eyes? Hash 1. Drink plenty of water. Dehydrated skin can cause dark circles. Drinking enough water reduces the risk of black eye syndrome. To find your ideal water intake, Divide your weight in half. This gives you the number of ounces to drink daily. Water also helps transport nutrients to cells and flushes out toxins. Hash 2. Get more sleep. Lack of sleep makes the skin around your eyes darker. To fix this, aim for 7. 9 hours of sleep each night. Avoid drugs and alcohol and create a restful environment. If you're a night owl, try a sleep-friendly vitamin. Hash 3. Use an anti-aging cream. Anti-aging creams help with the skin under your eyes. They slow down the process of fat deposits breaking down. Over-the-counter products work well, but for serious issues, consider a stronger prescription formula. Eye creams are thicker and contain special ingredients for the delicate eye area. Whether prescription or over-the-counter, they can have lasting effects. Hash 4. Eat well and exercise. Vitamins play a big role in skin health. Vitamin K prevents skin discoloration, and vitamin B12 helps repair skin cells. Eat fruits, veggies, and potassium-rich foods. Cut back on salt. It can make your skin puffy. Exercise boosts blood flow, keeping your skin healthy. Hash 5. Treat the allergy. Certainly. Here's a simplified version. Allergies can cause dark circles under your eyes. Seasonal allergies can be treated with over-the-counter meds. But if it's a food, gluten, or chemical allergy, avoid it. Sometimes people don't realize they're allergic and keep eating the same things. Get allergy tested to be sure. Also. Take care of your sinuses. Stuffy noses can make veins around your eyes look darker. Hash 6. Direct application, certainly. Here's a simplified version. To reduce dark circles and puffiness, try a cold compress, not ice, on your eyes. You can use tea bags, high in caffeine, or chilled cucumbers. Steep the tea bags as directed, then cool them in the fridge or freezer before placing them over your closed eyes. But be cautious if you have allergies or sensitive skin. Hash 7. Plastic Surgery Sometimes, natural remedies can't fix inherited issues. Surgery might be the last option. Research the procedure and potential complications. There's no wrong way to handle this. Find peace until you discover a solution that works for you. Accept what can't change and fix what you can.